Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about Roosevelt Roberts versus Ludovic Klein. Ludovic Klein, 22 wins, 4 losses, 1 draw. He is 4-0-1 in his last 5 fights. 29 years old, 5-7 with a 72 and a half inch reach. Fighting Roosevelt Roberts, who's 12-4, 2-2-0-1 in his last 5 fights. Fights. He's 30 years old, 6'2", with a 73-inch reach, half-inch reach advantage for Roberts, and boy, what is that, 4, 5, 6, 7 inches in height? Wild. But, if th th this matchup is so weird, because for one, Ludwig Klein should be fighting somebody in the top 15, that's the reality. I like Roberts personally as a fighter, I, I, I just like a comeback story, but got destroyed by Rebecca. Very hard fight for him to come back on. He got a couple wins, good wins, outside of the UFC. Guy obviously got wheel kicked by Ignacio Bahamandas. We now know how good Bahamandas is. He's 4-1, or 5-1 since the uh, Rosa Roberts fight. So, yeah, there's that. But Ludwig Klein, he's just really, really good. The one draw against Jai Herbert, which is a little bit weird, but I do think Jai Herbert is better than what his record shows. Since then, he's beaten Bahamandas, AJ Cunningham, and Tiago Moises, which was supposed to be his coming out party. And yet, they scheduled him against Nicholas Moda, and now Roosevelt Roberts. So it was a very, very weird, very weird fight. So 22 wins, like I said. He's only been in a decision five times, 17 finishes. Now, he hasn't finished three times, one by TKO, two by submission, only one uh, finish in the UFC, and that's by submission. I believe that was, uh, yeah, Nate Landwehr, Anaconda in round three. Different weight class since then, has not lost. Beaten Devontae Smith by split, which is weird. Beat Mason Jones, destroyed Mason Jones. He's really good now. I believe he's on a big win streak, 15-2. and two. So, yeah, there's that. Four wins in a row. He four wins in a row since then. He's beaten some pretty decent guys, too. So, but yeah, beaten some really, really good fighters. Lost to Michael Trezano and Nate Landwehr, which is just weird to think about because he's been on such a streak, you know. But 6-2-1, and one, you know, two finishes, four decisions. Which is weird because he only has five total decisions. But he's fighting better competition than he was outside the Octagon. So yeah. Uh, but he, he's he's just very good. The one flaw with Ludovic, I would will say, is as the fight goes, he does get tired. That is a flaw with him. We've seen it before. It happened with the Moises fight. His shots weren't as powerful in, in the later rounds. The problem with that, or the problem with, for that for... Roberts is I don't know how how long Roberts can survive nine finishes out of 12 wins been finished three out of four times in his career three times in the UFC he's been finished he's 4-4-0-1 oh, in the UFC again beat lost to Rebecca which nothing to hold your head down on that one that's that's whatever that's okay get destroyed by Bahamandas was losing in the fight to begin with and then rushed on Jim Miller and got submitted. And then his one his loss before that was against Vincent Pichel. So <laughs> the thing that sucks with him is I do think he could be good. I, I really, really do with just about obviously putting it all together. This is just a terrible, terrible matchup for him. Fighting a guy that's like Rebecca, just maybe not as as explosive. I just don't know where Roberts can do good work. I, I guess if he's able to catch uh, Ludovic Klein coming in, stumble him, use his height, use his reach. He only has a half inch reach advantage, but he has a big height. So use your kicks as teeps. Use, you know, front kicks. Try to keep that distance, but I don't think he's going to be able to keep that distance for very long. Now, this is the day after my birthday. Again, I will be live for it. You bet your ass I will be. But as I as always, guys, Ludwig Klein by finish. It's going to be a weird fight. It really is. But as always, guys, thank you for supporting. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.